Hi, uh, this video tutorial I will cover uh, decorated design pattern implementation. Uh, before you watch this video tutorial, please log into my channel and watch uh, decorated design pattern introduction, decorated design pattern class diagram and uh, decorated design pattern uh, real time example video tutorials. Then come and watch this tutorial so that you will understand this tutorial very clearly. Okay. Now we will see the scenario where we can use uh, decorated design pattern. In the left side you can see a car, uh, it doesn't have uh, any engine. Okay. Uh, suppose I want to add uh, uh, petrol engine or diesel engine to this uh, uh, car. So what I have to do is uh, I have to introduce uh, car decorator. So what this uh, car decorator will do is uh, suppose say I want uh, a car with uh, petrol engine means uh, it will add petrol engine to this uh, car and uh, it will give uh, car with uh, petrol engine. Okay. Suppose say I want to uh, add uh, diesel engine to this car, uh, this car decorator will add diesel engine to the car and uh, it will give a uh, car with uh, diesel engine. Okay. So as per uh, decorator design button, the decorator uh, uh, work is it will add additional uh, functionality or additional feature or additional behavior to the existing object. So in this case uh, car without engine is the existing object. Uh, what the car decorator uh, does is it will add uh, petrol engine to the car or diesel engine to the car based on our uh, requirement okay so uh, this is the best real time example of uh, decorator design pattern this is the class diagram of the scenario which you have uh, just discussed uh, in the top you can see car interface it has a manufacture car method which is abstract method and this car interface is implemented by a uh, BMW car uh, which is concrete class and uh, this BMW car uh, provides implementation of uh, manufacture car method so when you call this uh, manufacture car method what it will uh, do is uh, it will uh, uh, manufacture the car and uh, it will return the BMW car to the car but uh, it doesn't have uh, any engine okay it will have a uh, car body car door car wheels and uh, car glass uh, but engine won't be there and uh, car decorator uh, which is abstract uh, class and it also provides implementation of uh, uh, car interface and uh, provide implementation of uh, manufacturing method and this abstract class is uh, extended by uh, two concrete classes the first class is uh, diesel car decorator and uh, second class is uh, petrol car decorator uh, and it provides implementation of uh, manufacture car basically it will override uh, manufacture car in the car decorator uh, class and uh, it will add engine to the uh, BMW car okay so diesel car decorator will add uh, diesel engine to the BMW car uh, petrol car decorator will add uh, uh, petrol engine to the uh, BMW car basically this uh, two decorator class are used to uh, decorate the car okay so when you call this uh, bmw car you will get the bmw car without engine and uh, this car decorators uh, classes are used to add uh, engine to the bmw car so if you use uh, diesel car decorator it will add uh, uh, diesel engine to the car if you uh, if you use uh, petrol car decorator it will add uh, petrol engine to the car okay and left side top you can see a decorator client and it has uh, main method uh, this class is used to explain this uh, decorator design pattern. I will open Eclipse and I will show you the code so that you will understand very clearly. I have opened Eclipse, uh, now we will see the code. Uh, here you can see the interface car and it has a manufacture car method. Uh, this method is a abstract method. And this interface is implemented by uh, BMW car which is a uh, concrete class. Uh, you can see uh, it implements uh, car interface and uh, this this class provides the implementation of uh, manufacture car method okay and uh, what this uh, method does is uh, it will uh, uh, manufacture uh, car with uh, car body car door car glass and uh, car wheels so when you call this uh, manufacture car uh, method uh, it will return the bmw car uh, without engine okay and it will have a car body, car door, car glass and car wheels.
and uh, next class is uh, car decorator uh, which is abstract class and uh, it also implements uh, car interface and uh, provide implementation of uh, manufacture uh, car method okay and uh, this diesel car uh, decorator which extends uh, abstract class car decorator and it overrides uh, manufacture car method okay so what this manufacture car method will do is it will add uh, uh, diesel engine to the car and it will return the BMW car with uh, diesel engine okay basically uh, this car, diesel car decorator will uh, decorate uh, BMW car with uh, diesel engine and uh, next class is uh, petrol car decorator and uh, this class also extends uh, car decorator abstract class and it overrides the manufacture car method so this method what it will do is it will uh, first uh, uh, manufacture the BMW car and it will uh, add a petrol engine to the uh, BMW car and it will return uh, BMW car with uh, petrol engine basically it will decorate uh, BMW car with uh, petrol engine okay and uh, decorator client class as main method uh, so first what I am doing is I am creating uh, uh, BMW car one object and uh, then I am passing to the diesel car decorator so that I can add uh, uh, diesel engine to the BMW car okay and uh, here what I am doing is I am creating BMW car 2 object I am passing BMW car 2 object to the petrol car decorator so that uh, I can add uh, petrol engine to the BMW car I will run this program and I will show you the output uh, so that you will understand very clearly so here uh, I am just uh, creating the BMW car okay and uh, I, I pass to the uh, uh, diesel car decorator so that uh, engine will be added right so you can see diesel uh, car decorator added diesel engine to the car uh, I will show you here so you can see engine uh, initially it will be null and now you can see uh, engine is uh, diesel engine so like that uh, uh, petrol engine is added to the car so you can see engine is uh, petrol engine okay so this is the best example of uh, decorated design pattern i hope you understand the implementation of uh, decorated design pattern clearly and uh, i have put together all the sample code uh, related to this uh, decorated design pattern in my blog called uh, ramjt you can just visit this uh, blog and you can get the sample code and this is about the implementation of uh, decorated design pattern thanks for watching bye